Hey guys, in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can scan a document and save it as a PDF file on the Samsung Galaxy S24 series. First, tap on the home button to return back to the home screen. And from the home screen or in the app screen, open up the camera app. In the camera app, tap on the settings icon at the top corner, then in the camera settings, tap on scan documents and text. Make sure the toggle button is turned on. Then tap on the home button to go back to the home screen. Next, open up your camera app and then place your camera or point the camera at the document that you want to uh, capture. Now, because I have the reflection right here, so I will need to readjust uh, the documents or the camera so that it doesn't have a lot of reflection on the camera. So here, so I'm going to point my camera as the document right here. Then tap on the capture button right here on the text button right there. Tap on it. All right. If you see the scan button, this will try to scan your document as an image. So if you need to readjust, you can tap on retake. So tap on the retake button here and then just simply readjust your um, selection. Uh, on the camera, then tap on the text button or the scan button. After that, if you are happy with the document, then tap on scan. Now from here, you can use the handle to change your document selection. So you can make it smaller. If I, if you simply just want to capture this part right here, we can readjust the handle to capture only that part. Like so. You can also rotate the document and then tap on saved. So tap on saved. Now, once you tap on the save button, it will save the image to your gallery. So here, if I open up my picture gallery and here you can see this document here, if I go into information, you can see the image is saved as a JPEG, which is an image format. So what you want to do is go back in here, then tap on the more button and then tap on print next. Up here, make sure you choose save as PDF from the drop down and then choose the paper size. So, in here, we're going to select A4. So, if I can uh, find paper size A4, so this one here at the moment is set to letter, I don't want that. So, let's find A4. So, it's quite a long list, so we're just going to go down and choose the right size, uh, the right document size. So here we've got letter or government letter. They're pretty much uh, the size of the A4 paper. And then after that, you can choose whether to save in color or black and white. You can choose whether to save this as double sided or single because this is a PDF document. So we're not going to print out into a half copy. So there's no uh, double sided. So we're none. And here we can save as a portrait or a landscape mode. So I'm going to select it as portrait mode and then tap on PDF button. Next, we need to choose a storage folder where it will save to. So I'm going to select documents and then tap on saved. And that's it. So once it is um, saved, uh, you can open up files. So here I'm going to go to my home screen and open up my files and then tap on the file that you just recently saved. In here, you can open it with OneDrive, Drive, Microsoft, 365, or Samsung Notes. So I'm going to choose Samsung Notes to open up my PDF document. In here, if I go into information, so uh, here we've got the print, uh, save as file or share. So if I tap on share, here I can share PDF file. Because this is already a PDF file, as you can see here, it's got .pdf, so that is already a PDF file. Then I can uh, send it to my email. So I'm just going to test, change that email there. So I'm just going to delete that one. I'll just so I did Django tests and then test doc and then tap on the send. 
And that's it. So once you have uh, saved as a PDF document, you can also send that uh, document via email or via messenger, or you can upload it to uh, the website. And that's it. So that is how you can uh, scan a document and save it as a PDF file. And here is my Gmail. So you can see that is the document right there. I can tap on it to open up uh, the document with OneDrive, for example. And that's it. So that is my PDF document right there. Thank you for watching this video. Please like and subscribe to my channel for my videos.